All right. So, um, a little explanation as to what's going on is probably needed, uh, just so y'all are aware of where I stand at this point in the game. Uh, as far as the real world is concerned, I just released the, uh, the Q&A video or episode 46 today. Um, that was like two hours ago. So I haven't been able to read through very many comments yet, but most of them have been like, awesome, two hours, and that's basically all the comments have gotten to yet, because nobody's had a chance to watch the whole video. Um, anyway, last night, due to what I did in the, um, uh, in the Q&A video where I would go around probing planets, a couple of times I ran across little mini-missions or, or things that I had found, and I found... I went ahead and decided to uh, go around and probe all the planets, and I'll show you. Oh, well, no, that's not what I want. It's over here. There we go. So I've gone to every individual location, and I've probed 100% of the planets and revealed a bunch of other missions. Uh, so all of these locations should say 100% now, which is nice. Um, I did not do any missions. Uh, however, <laughs> I did end up picking up some more... Uh, God, I don't know what you call it. Some more like Iridium and Element Zero and stuff. So now I have a ton of leftover stuff, more so than what I got in the probing video. Um, as you can probably see here, like platinum, 127,000 platinum, uh, 51,000 element zero, palladium, all that good stuff. So anytime another upgrade comes up, I should be able to just immediately purchase it. Um, but the, primarily, the primary reason for doing all of that was so that I could get all of the extra mini missions. So that's what I'm going to do these next couple of videos, probably. Uh, let's see, all of these N7 labeled ones are what I would assume to be mini-missions, but before I do that, I haven't been to the Citadel since the very beginning of the game, and I remember that there was one section that I didn't think I could get into, so I wanted to go see if it was available yet. Let's see what's over there. Pretty confident I'll get some good responses on my Q&A video, but we'll see how that goes. Also, the survey video is going pretty well. Survey video. The survey... Um, yeah, I'll take you. That's going pretty well to figure out what I'm going to be playing next. There we go. Um, okay, I have no idea where I was going last time. But let's just wander around for a few minutes real quick. Just see if I missed anything. Hmm, where am I? Do 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 do. I want to say the dock is where I was? Or maybe it was 27 I couldn't get to? The Serta Foundation? Where is 27? Serta Foundation. I thought I could get there. Level... 28. Maybe that was 28, and this is 27. And this is 26. Where the hell is 27? Hold on. I'm sorry. I wish these were labeled, like, section something or other. Twenty-seven. Here you'll find C-Sec offices and Citadel souvenirs. 
So I'm in 26. Maybe the factory district was where I was. Let's, let's just wander around one time. See if there's anything new. I highly doubt it. I should probably check in on these stores. I think Shepard, I did that a while this back. Is my favorite store on the Citadel. No items. That's kind of what I thought. I just... He's my baby. He's all I have left of Jacob. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Might as well buy it. I got plenty of money now. Hmm. Do you sell anything? You ever like had real? It's a delicacy back on Earth. No, I guess not. What about you? Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. Hmm. Only slightly used, yes. Well, that's a disappointment. I can't believe these humans. No fly lists? What did they turn this place into? I overheard you talking. Having a problem? It's a private matter. Give me a chance. I might be able to help. I don't see why you would. Since your kind gained a seat on the council, they've taken over CSEC customs. There are hundreds of new security checks and travel restrictions. We've been flagged as a potential risk for geth infiltration. They won't let us board a ship back to Asari space. Huh. Why would they consider you a risk? You're obviously not Geth. I don't know. They wouldn't tell us. We got on a list somewhere for some reason, and they won't tell us anything because it's classified. Who won't let you board a ship? I don't know who made the decision. Some pencil pusher at the shuttle port told us. The one outside the C-Sec station? I'll see if I can get it sorted out. I'm not holding my breath. Interesting. This guy, I think. Is it you I need to talk to? Yes. Um. Abusing suspects, maybe? I overheard your conversation. Make him scream a little? This isn't a presidium. All they have to worry about are protesters outside their free speech zones or someone's poodle crapping on the ground. Down here, we have drugs. Organized crime and murder. Policing a ward is like policing New York City. Sometimes you have to work outside the council's rule book. He sounds like a certain Turian we know. <laughs> Good point. Hmm, apparently it's not you. I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. Neither y'all want to talk to me. And he doesn't. Let's see if they're out here. She said it was out near customs, right? You'll have to wait for the next shuttle. You made me miss the last one. Can I help you, sir? Oh, yeah. I talked to a couple of Asari. They say customs won't let them leave the station, but they weren't told why. Can you help me out? I'm sorry, sir, but all matters related to station security are classified. We can't risk guest infiltration. Revealing why someone is on a watch list might compromise the safety of c -Sex undercover agents. Did you talk with them? Did they seem like Geth agents to you? Well, no, but you can never be sure. Look, miss, I've fought hundreds of Geth. I can assure you that those two aren't Geth infiltrators. The lack of flashlight heads was kind of a giveaway. I'm not saying it makes any sense. Those are the rules I have to enforce. I can't get them cleared, but I can flag the case file for review. That will allow them to travel in the meantime. Is there anything else I can do for you? I'm fine. Thanks for your help. Next. Now well, let's go tell her what I've been able to do. At least that's something, right? She's over here somewhere. I stopped by that shop. Are you over there? No. Oh. Hello. So? Good news. I convinced them to let you go. You what? How did you do that? I explained how their methods are flawed. I fought a lot of Geth in my time. Few have. 
How unexpected. We should get ready to leave. There should be another ship heading to Thessia tomorrow. You're welcome. I guess. You sell anything interesting in here? Oh, it's the cafe. No, you don't. Come on, please. You have to help me. I need to make something nice. It's for it. And then this is the souvenirs. I think I bought everything. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Oh, a couple of fish, though. Why not? They'll die, but that's all right. I don't care. Maybe buying all the fish unlocks something later. And don't tell me if it does. Because if by my definition, that's a spoiler. Let's see, there were a couple of shops here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Maybe I already bought all this stuff out. Sure seems that way. Hmm. Oh well. I wish they still made role-playing games like they used to. These days it's all big choices and visceral combat. I miss those old games where you had to remember to drink water. Yeah. He had to remember to drink water. Forget that. Okay. So I guess there really wasn't anything interesting here at all. That was kind of a letdown. Oh well. It would have bothered me to no end that I had never returned here, so... Uh, Normandy. Okay, so let's see what we got. Anomalous weather detected. Duranda system Pylos Nebula. Okay, we'll just start there, I guess. Start at the top and work my way down. Um, Pylos Nebula, there it is. Okay, I guess it's that disable geth device. Yeah, Duranda. There's no N in that. Dorada. See what's going on down here. Geth device, huh? Standard crew. Thank you. Uh, let's check weapons. Hand cannon is good. Huh. No upgraded weapons in a while. Wow, it is thick. Sorry. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, that's not good. Um. I 
can't see Jack. Yeah, there ain't gonna be any long distance shooting here. Hmm. I barely see. Oh! oh. Sorry. <laughs> I'm a little jumpy, I guess. Not that I really need palladium, but... I can't see anything. Oh, that's frustrating. Eat this. Here, uh, you come up here. Got it. Across. Pop that slowly away. Jesus. Sucks not being able to see anything. Oops. Cover. I'm here. Uh-huh. Some more stuff I can pick up. I'm getting close. Anything back here? What the hell is that thing? There it is. Good, there's some ammo up here. Can I pick that up, please? No? There we go.
Geth access. Okay. That was relatively straightforward. Used a buttload of ammo, though, man. I was getting nervous there at the end. When I only had double digits worth of ammo left, I was like, uh, Thick smoke makes assault um, sniper rifles poor choices. Okay. Uh, got a couple of upgrades. Might as well. Nope. Armor. Heavy muscle weave. Hell yeah. Melee attack is now pro more powerful. Not that I'm really going to use that, but it's better than nothing, right? Okay. All right, what's next? Blood Pack Communication Relay. Crescent Nebula Lasarn System. That was a loud key press. Uh, no, I need to leave. Crescent Nebula's over here. Something about the blood pack. Blood pack relay. There it is. Oops. Stop moving. Maybe now I can use my sniper rifle. Uh, more so, at least. Uh oh. I remember you. The fog on the planet's surface is interfering with your navigation. The nearby beacon towers may serve as a navigational contingency. Okay. Navigational contingency, huh? Uh. Right behind you. Hmm. Activate the beacon. I'd rather not. What happened here? that thing. We should be careful. This atmosphere is toxic. Well, I'm glad you mentioned that before we landed. Oh. Incoming! Oh! You're supposed to. It's about to say you're supposed to blow up that way. Now I see what they mean about these beacon things.
That doesn't bode well. Oh, got him on fire. Got it. On it. Oh shit, it's you. I was like, die! in there. Where's Tolly? Come on. There you go. Oops. You can go up or down. That's left. Oh, no, that's right. Yeah, let's let's go up. Got it. Right, Shepard. Where are you two? What the You just left me by myself. Thanks a lot. I wonder what they were doing here. I don't know. What's up with all these foggy planets? Let's go this way. Y'all even here? No, of course not. Can do. Right, Shepard. Where the hell are you guys? This is not. Oh, what the hell? God, I hate you guys. Hmm. There she is. Will you please stay up here? Jesus. Let's go this way. There's stuff and junk. Um, there's nothing. Let's go the other way. Okay, good. The fog's lifting. Can y'all keep up now? God, y'all's pathfinding sucks. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but there's an ice cream man outside! Ice cream man! Okay. Oh, he left. Lack of fog didn't last very long, did it? Neither did y'all's following me. Gear up! Oop. I 
explode. Thank you. Aha. This way. I guess we're going up to that thing. Your data pad. Not making each other very happy, are they? On it. Seriously, people? Yeah, yeah. Did y'all go up here without me? Ah, screw it. I'm tired of waiting up for you guys. I'm here. Oh. Right behind you. Go figure. You know, if only the pod had landed us like right here. Gunfire. Weapons ready. I can't charge it. Just my shield. Combat team. Target charging. I can get while I'm here, because I'm pretty sure that's going to end the mission. Sounds good to me, I guess.